hey guys welcome back to my channel yes this is candy if it is your first time um pretty much my channel is uh focused on doing hair tutorials or hair care um you know videos and you know vlogs and stuff but yeah welcome if it's your first time but today my hair is in um a bad shape i would say it's in need of a cut and and so i'm gonna be you know going ahead and cutting my hair here look terribly dirty this is actually the residue from gel though so let's cut it together yeah i think i might want to do a bob i'm not sure yet um yeah but it's hair cutting day you guys and um let's just do this together yes Together, together, together. All right, so let me first make a disclaimer. I have not been in any way personally trained on hair cutting. I am not aware of any of the professional cutting techniques. And so, yeah, I'm just pretty much doing a layman's cut. All right, so, yeah. All right, let us try to, and um, I know that there is some um argument or talk as to if it's better to cut the hair when it's wet or dry. I am not pretty sure what that conclusion is. However, I'm going to be cutting mine while it's dry today. And I feel like you'll see the length of the hair better when it's dry. That's my, just that's my reasoning. I'm not sure. All right, so. Alright, so I want to get off at least an inch or two. Haven't trimmed my hair in a while. The ends feel very dry and frayed and yeah, it needs to go. Alright, so let's start here. not a lot but that's a starting point so let's keep it going more came up on this side <laughs> Boy. yeah definitely I think I cut this side shorter than the other side so yes <laughs> mm -hmm. so you know what that means hmm. let's go back in and take off a little bit more of over here
And you want to make sure that your hair is um, at least blown out or you know somewhat straight because you get a more precise cut that way. I mean, like I said, I'm no professional, I'm an amateur at this cutting thing, but I do know that um, at, at least you need to have your hair. You know, elongate it somewhat so that you actually can see the amount of hair that you're cutting.
but I guess as the weeks pers um, progress, I will be able to see if it's doing what I want it to do. And then I can probably go in and trim more if I need to trim more. Or, you know, when it's styled, I'll be able to see if one side is too long or one side is shorter than the other, you know. And I kind of want it that way, though. I kind of wanted it to have more of a, an angular type look, meaning, well, I wanted one side to be shorter than the other, put it that way. So I need to figure out, you know, which side is going to be my dominant side. Because sometimes I find that when I style my hair over to one particular st uh, side, it looks fuller than the other. So I need to figure out what, which is the side that looks fuller. And then make that be the dominant side. I think this side. Yeah, I, I naturally prefer it to fall to the right, but sometimes it doesn't look quite as full as I want when it's on the right. But I think it's 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 better on this side. Yeah. But once it's styled, we will see. All right. So yeah, I just wanted to get your company to cut my hair and to see you know if it turned out somewhat decent. All right, so it's hair washing time. Thank you guys for keeping me company and I will see you on my very next video. Take care. Remember to like, rate, subscribe and share. Yes, and we will talk on the next one. Bye.